Hello, my name is Jessica, and welcome to the quick guide of the purchase order e-form. Let's get started. You can start by typing or choosing a name of a vendor from the list. The vendor information can be filled in based on the database, or you can complete the information manually. You may also upload documents to be added with the purchase order, or create a PDF and have it emailed to the preparer of your choosing as well as set up a required by date in the terms area. The purchase order items can be filled in by using the edit pencil. Input the information and select the green check to confirm. All the items are added up and then totaled. GL codes and amounts may be also added into the e-form. Once you've selected submit, then the PDF is created. Now that the purchase order is in PDF form, you can then review for accuracy, edit, send for additional approval, or submit it to the document management system. This concludes our quick guide into the purchase order eForm. I hope you found this video helpful. If you would like to see some more other videos, click the links below. Thank you for watching and may you have a very nice day.